Off to the races. 18 v 18. OP first right, light. What is the plan? Mobius, my squad and your squad are going to storage site. I'd like to welcome Doc East to the stream. Uh, one of our other clan fob. members out there We're joined into uh, rallies and hopefully only use rallies and not need the fob. Here to cover this match with us. What's up, Doc? What's going on, guys? We're going to attack the uh, south side of the map. Uh, I'm on that way on storage. So Raleigh going out ahead, scouting out the first Keep flag, rail side. docks. And uh, squad five and seven moving to the village, and squad Please. four moving up to storage site for SFSS. We'll go to the southeast side. You go to the southwest side. You can hear them on Commander Com splitting up their uh, splitting up their stuff. Where they're gonna go? I'd like to say welcome to uh, Age of Kill guys to their first uh, squad league match. Uh, SFSS played the first day we hosted one. But uh, so this is the first new clan we've had in a while. It's been a lot of familiar faces thus yeah, far. Yeah, absolutely. So how this map typically sets up too? It seems that you know that the a lot of the first contact will happen around the warehouse or storage site rather. Doc, I don't see anybody uh, in placing your typical strategy on this one thus far. <laughs> nope, no, it doesn't look like it. What's your strategy, nope. Doc? Uh, I don't know if I want to broadcast it, but... <laughs> 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 sure, it's, sure, it's been figured out quite well. This map, this map's all about terrain. Right. Um, there's certain key points of terrain you control on this map. You can control a pretty good portion of the map. Get, uh, so, uh, that center ridge line is, is not moving. Scout out where they're coming from. So, Rusty, make sure to move up to storage site. That's where we're about to start seeing this happen. Yeah, that's... Looks like SFSS got in there first. Yep. And now you've got uh, Age OK coming, Age of Kill coming through the, the forest, about to hit it up. Yep. Yeah, they're in the tree lines. It looks like. I may have spoke too soon on that. But it looks like they may not have uh, been able to push up fast enough. You got SFSS. They're definitely they're waiting on it. They know it's coming. They're all looking yeah. in the northern direction, waiting. Well, they're going to get a two prong attack on storage because they've got it. Um, some guys coming through the woods from the east. And oh from yeah, the from north. the north. End, yep, north and the east. Yep. We're captain. We're captain. First contact. Ooh. Yeah, A1 sauce went down on that one. Uh, scary punk next to him. I don't know if the medic's going to try to get over there and bring him up. Oh, another place, well placed rocket on that one. Uh, Spaceman Spiff just went down. I think he was trying to get over to uh, heal one of the guys. So we got a lot of SFSS uh, out there in the west from train wreck. Coming in from that the might start hitting uh, them. Watch, they're yeah. about to hit uh, Age of Kill on that that northern area. And they've got a lot of Age of, Kill, Age of Kill out to the east as well. If you guys take a peek over there. I'm yep, going to pop up yep. for an overhead shot just so we can get a look at all the troops going on here. Oh, yeah, we've got quite a bit of a spread. Yeah, a lot of AOK -OK guys coming over to the uh, east now. That that could be a very good play on their part. Um, yeah, we'll right see now, SFSS is really looking to hit. They're thinking that the storage site's getting hit really hard. Those Squad guys out east might have slipped down. They're right seeing their, their rally the point rally. right there. Uh, Age of Kill is. So A1 Sauce and all those guys just got capped. Yep, that, that rally's about to get uh, uh, taken. As I was saying, that, that center uh, ridge line, man, Razor Kill just capitalized on. Got a clean shot straight to Nilrim. Yep, Squad 4's rally is definitely compromised on that one. You still at storage site, Rusty? Yeah, I'm still just kind of coming above storage. Following these uh, SFSS guys to the west now. Hey, okay, now in storage. So I assume Age of Kill is is probably taking that one back now because there's no we got no FS, SFSS inside there and hey, hey, got you got them hunkered down inside store side itself. Seeing so keep in mind, remember we have to call this match ourselves right. uh, on one, this one at 150 because 150. there's no skirmish. Right. Okay. 
seeing some of these medics go down for SFSS. It's like we said in the last match, those medics are so important. Gotta keep those medics Absolutely. Alright, so you got quite a bit of Age of Kill filling in on storage site now. Yeah, absolutely. To uh, support that. Also got three slipping down a nil rem. Looks like they're prepping themselves yeah, for the they're as prep as they take storage. Yeah, absolutely. We'll see if SFSS picks up on that. Because uh, you got a whole squad out there with uh, A1 sauce right now, but it looks like they have another agenda of where they're moving to. Yeah, they're going to get they're gonna get ninja capped on nil rem right now. Six snipes and uh, A1 sauce. They're taking that center ridge line like Bob's I was talking down, about. but. Guys. I think they might have been a little bit too late on that movement. Wait, your kill's moving back out. They're they're not sitting on that. Yeah, I'm sitting over squad Either four southern, right now. Yeah. yeah. But uh, squad seven just got a fob up in the uh, southwestern part. Yes, I was actually about to comment on that as well. They were going to need some kind of spawn support here pretty soon. If they didn't get that up, it, it's going to be a bad day. Now, I know uh, Age of Kill, they're uh, one of our French clans. I think they're actually our only French clan. So, I don't know. None of us speak French except for um, Oakley over there. I don't know, Oakley, if you're hearing anything from their comms. Are they speaking in French over there? Yeah, they are. Down. It's pretty intense over here. A lot of communication <laughs> between the squad. They, they are, so sure. they are using a lot of squad squad comms? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Pretty quiet on this side. Yeah, we're not hearing a lot of, of comms on this side. I'm actually kind of excited to get over to AOK and, and hear them... Uh, Screaming in French. <laughs> oh, that'll be awesome. I have cap storage. Go. Oh. All right. Take, they, take so... a peek at storage. Yeah. 42 seconds. For them. They have to be very close to cap and storage. It looks like Agent Kill has already sent out their. Uh... Oh yeah, they're about to ninja cap. They got three dudes already sitting in. Uh, what is it, Northfield Village? Yeah, about to be four. Nilrin village. Right now, Nilrin. SFSS is probably freaking out. I'm not hearing anything from the squad net. A1 South squad might be... getting absolutely lit right now from AOK. -OK. Yeah, I'd be dropping down south at the Finmark right now. They should be dropping smoke. Medics are going crazy. Their AR is down over here. Still got their grenadier you up. You know, AOK, -OK, the engagement with, uh, what is that, A1 Sauce's group. What's nice about what they're doing is they're. They're, they're basically pinning that squad into an area that doesn't really How you guys doing there, cap or attack, defender attack uh, a flag, you know what I mean? They're holding them out there. Second animal one sauce is down. Yeah. SFSS? Yeah. See if, like, holding that storage site, you hold that ridge line where they're at and watch east. Oh. That whole ridge line that feeds all the way up from their main into storage site. So a very good approach on the storage. A lot of times if you plant a few people on the defend mark and a few guys up there, you can stop any movement. Grumpy, thanks for that donation, man. Appreciate it. Thank you, brother. I appreciate that, man. Hey, Oaks, do they have any fobs on their side? Um, yes, they do. They've got one just north of the storage site. Raj. So we've got one in the south. Uh, Basically uh, south-southwest of uh, Nilrim Village. Yeah, we've got 279 tickets now. I'm just coming over to storage. How much are you sitting at, Oaks? 295, so... Wow. Oh, Still wow. You're going to see some serious panic coming out of SFSS here in a moment. They cap no rem and neutralize it. All yeah, AOK we'll has see to if right they try to start pulling everyone back. Yeah. yeah that's that's going to be the point where you really get, it's going to come down to the squad leads to kind of coordinate. Because is it essentially, in a, in a, here in a minute, they, they need to give up on storage site. And to me, you would want to regroup, make sure recollect everybody, and then sort out your push again, you know? Right now, they're just spaced so far apart. Ooh, there yeah. it goes. Watch everybody start running south now. We need help with the defense point. We're losing it. Yep, yep and there's the commander comms coming in on it. So, Sauce is, A1 Sauce is bringing his squad down. Doesn't look like the other guys have broke, broke engagement on storage site yet, though. Why do you hold? We're, we'll try to get this defense point. Oh, it's about to go down on nil rim. Rusty, where are you covering? I am right over uh, as uh, A1 Sauce's squad right now. Okay, coming down on Nil Rim. Gotcha. Yeah. So, and it looks like Age of Kill, too. They're each out between all the houses, so they're not... You shoot a grenade or a rocket in there, you're, you're only going to take out one at a time. This also has guys coming up behind him as well. We're still on storage and taking it. Say they're taking storage. They well, must now it have comes pushed to, them back out. Yeah. yeah, it looks like it. Now it comes down to time. If they can hold 
SFSS long enough. Are you okay? They can they can cap down on no run. Hey Gunther, I think we need your help at the defense point. Bear back. We're on the way. We're on the way. Yep. Hear more comms punk. from them. Yeah, scary punk getting his guys up here. Anyone sauce is now up. Virus We're gonna try the corner. and be, be cap this point. Um, oh man, virus gets those two defense. kills. Easy. Spaceman Spiff, now the only guy left. Oh, and he's down too. So yeah, A1's uh, squad wasn't able to uh, get these AOK guys out of the uh, village here. Raleigh's still coming in though. Magoo in the back. Gunther as well. Zooming back over to storage here. Seeing a lot of red. AOK coming in from the north. Hugging that uh, tree line. Using that as cover. SFSS using the buildings to their advantage. As well as that uh, that high ground to the west. You can see uh, Ender and Lacase up, up, up on top of there. Yep, there goes. There goes the village. FSS wasn't quite quick enough. Yep. All you okay had to do is just hold them off long enough there so they could uh, cap nil run. Now comes the part where you could possibly overextend yourself as an attacking team. Now you okay is kind of in a tight spot because they've got a lot of guys between them and their guys to the north. Right. Yeah, they definitely got a lot in the north who you know probably got to start sprinting down here to to support that because now they're going to want to sustain exactly that throttle right there. Especially with an enemy fob nearby. Yeah. No, They're so spaced the out right now through the forest. Hey, okay, or every, everybody is S really SFSS easy. on the, yeah. uh, you know, the, the, oh, what side is it? Yeah, I'm pulling back now for a top down, and it's, uh, wow. Pretty a scattered. Lot of, lot of, yeah, a lot of scatter going on. But it looks like A1 Sauce has got his, uh, at least himself and Scary Punk are going on the offensive at the uh, the the rail yard there. Well, so I just look at like like Magoo. Point. We can't let him take that one. Yep. We need everybody back to our very first point. Aok -OK is going to take that point as well. They got enough bodies there. Absolutely. Magoo, Lacasse, and Ender. They're just what are they doing out there? I don't know if they're trying to find any feelers. You know what I mean? Very aggressive from Aok. -OK. That's what you want, especially on this map. Use that terrain, use that foliage, and be aggressive. Absolutely. Violence and force of action, that's going to get you the, Actually. Uh, yeah, the yep. advantage there. Absolutely. And then you can hear A1 Sauce on the comms saying that, you know, everybody's got to fall back. We've got to take this first point before we can think about, you know, doing a two-prong attack or anything like that. So uh, we'll see what that, uh, how that plays and out. And out west right now, too. That fob's about to be in danger by another AOK squad. You see Age of Kill, they move very well as, as a squad. You know what I mean? You see, they keep together pretty tight. And if, if they're separated, I imagine it's on purpose. Definitely. They've also got a little bit more of a sense of, uh, right now, from what it looks like, a little bit more of a sense of their, the, the situation on the battlefield right now. They know that there's a possible fob down here to where Chancellor's at. Black Storm and these guys down to the west. Looks like they found they're that fob. Well, those guys are there. Yeah, they're about to find that fob. There's they no have found that. It. They'll take that down. They have found it. Are they shoveling it out? They are shoveling it out. Yep. That's going to be a ticket. Let's keep an eye on those tickets because we'll see how much that changes it. But I imagine F SFSS is spawning out of uh, main now at that point anyway. Right. Yeah, they're they're in full damage control right mode mode right now, SFSS is. Yeah, with that fob now gone, that frees up those four AOK -OK guys to now come on in the attack on the village, which is already... Uh, not looking too good for SFSS. I only got Spaceman Spiff and Wild Beam up. And the rest of the SFSS guys are coming now to the east, coming across the map to the rail yard, like A1 Sauce recommended. Why are they all out on that east side? Is there a FOB? Over? Oh, that's, another, that's the other defend flag now. Right, yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, taking a look at our defend flags here. It's a great, uh, great example of the whole... Uh, ACOGS or OP debate you'll see in the, in the community forums. Game in general. So what's the debate for people that don't know? Oh, well, it's pretty it's pretty obvious, really. Uh, especially with the U.S. versus militia. Militia only have, you know, the SVD compared to the U.S.'s copious amounts of ACOGS and scope weapons. So people will people will complain and, and uh, really cause a ruckus about... Uh, oh, you're talking, you're, you're, what you're arguing is the... Is the... The debate whether it's overpowering with all right. the scopes, yeah, right. and, and and I don't like you like you, what you're highlighting here is that no well placed clans know how to use the kits, know right. how to do what they need to do, uh, that doesn't really matter. Right, it comes down to coordination, communication. Blood fool, what's their uh, cap status there?
Coming up to you, hold on. I'm not talking going over SFSS. We're taking back rail dock. Sounds like they're taking back rail docks though. Looks like they might have a handle on that again. This might be a turning point here. Yeah, there's one more. A A1 sauce need look out. Here comes Trek real quick. Yeah, he went down. Major kills have anybody near there now? FSS should have nope. that unlocked now. They have one little outlier. Who's the Weeman guy out there? We're taking the point back. It's ours. Hey, you got something spawnable out here, it looks like. My squad will go defense if we got the cap. Yeah, now SFSS really descending on that uh, rail yard. You're gonna move to the next one? We're at 219 now. What are they at, Oaks? Uh, they still have 276 tickets over here. Okay. Oh, okay. Let's just so they definitely find defensive positions and try to dwindle their tickets down a bit. Age of Kill definitely took down that fob out there, so you know you had a you had a big ticket chunk hit out again. Right. Good for SFSS. They they kind of focused their efforts back here on uh, rail docks. Now they're gonna have to they have to get a hold of this this terrain, especially to the west. Um, that big, massive each kill force out there. Yeah, I mean, that's going to it's gonna be difficult for them because it's pretty much like starting the match over, except now your enemies are right outside of your defend flag. Absolutely. Yep, knocking on the door right there. Now the squad leads. i got to do that, that coordination dance right now. Yep, absolutely. Good. Okay, you know, but if you if you bring all your guys down Mobis, into the train the just because it's on the point... Team. It's it's tough because now Age of Kill can just sit out in those forts and just start lobbing in grenades and, and exactly. RPG rounds and stuff. Yep. That goes back to my point about this this map. Shoot, really any any map really being all about terrain. This one especially. There's a lot of good sight lines. Like where Age of Kill's at right now. That ridge is a very good sight on that whole train tracks. Pretty much command that whole position down there. Have one squad up there and the squad maneuver. Yeah, that that's a lot of Age of Kill coming in from the west. Yeah, and that force is going to be much better cover, I think, than the rail yard, because those objects to hide okay. behind are not going to be, provide a lot of cover. A lot of deaths for SFF. Yeah, you can see that almost the entire A1 saw squad going if down behind the blocks. You notice, too, Age of Kill have chosen to leave back a, uh, a little squad of four to sit on that uh, defend flag of theirs to just be sure that they don't see anyone trying to come around and penetrate behind them. That's an absolutely good tactic. I'll, many times I'll, I'll leave and I'll see other squad leaders do the same thing. Well, I'll leave at least one or two guys back there, even just as a sensor. But then again, at that point, you also got to be mindful of how far you move out and who's around there, because with that one guy, obviously, he's not going to be able to hold off much for long. So if you're making so a cross map push with one guy defending, has this close. Gunther guy they out here? Uh, What's he doing? Two oh three. Oh, that's squad seven, spawn on rally out there. Hey, okay, still staying aggressive now in the rail yard. Did they put down Oaks? Did they put down any uh, fobs any closer to that, or are they just dealing with rallies? Um, they did put down a new fob. Um, near the rail yard to the northwest of it. Near the uh, the rail docks, excuse me. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Rail docks, rail yards. Uh, I know. <laughs> I didn't know trains get pulled into. And docks. they're actually they're actually they were talking in squad comms. They're gonna use that to replenish ammo and just you know work the tickets. The fast just needs to make a play here. So if you're a squad lead though, Doc, what is the play here? What would you do? Uh, play here right now. Um, you you're squad you're SFSS. What are you doing? Right now, what I'd be thinking right now is, they obviously know that AOK is is on that western hilltop, looking down on top of them, right? Yep. Um, AOK looks like what they're doing is they're keeping a squad up there, keeping fire on them. So what SFSS needs to think about, keep guys putting rounds up to those hilltops up there, basically exchanging fire and just drawing that fire while somebody comes out of main along that ridge line and pushes them out. Best way to fight somebody on top of a hill hey, is uh, going on top of the hill with them. Spiff, they want to be fighting uphill, the, obviously. The yeah. So it looks like looks like that's what uh, SFSS is doing right now. Out of their main and heading that way. 
AOK now coming in. You sweep them off that hillside. Rail but, docks, though. Sweeping yeah, SFSS see, out of there. Might be too late, though. That's where it comes down to that, that aggressiveness and initiative. You see that opportunity. Those, those squad leads got to be on the ball. Otherwise, you, you'll get steamrolled. Especially against aggressive teams. I think what we're seeing from SFSS is they're uh, trying hey, to fight them five, uh, more directly, um, you know, getting close to them, getting those close five, kills, uh, while AOK -OK is engaging them at a distance, a and uh, and then starting so to move in from there. Yeah, I'm kind of kind of opposite as well, especially with SFSS having, having optics. Military. I see at least uh, two militia running around there. Yeah, Gunther, looking them behind you somewhere around about there. Yeah, watch out near the root container. Still see okay on that western hill uh, stuff, so one, still three guys up there. But... There's no one at the attack point. I'm in it right now. Never mind, I just took a, just took one shot. One shot, one person. There's at least two over here. There's at least two over I can't tell. Are they trying to do some fob hunting? Some of these, because you see a, quite a few guys that are out there individually. Like you mean Magoo like out Magoo there? Like Magoo out there. Yeah, and that's I mean... their medic too, you know? Yeah, yeah. Interesting choice to... there. Especially as a medic. Yeah, if I were, I mean, I mean personally, if when I'm squad lead, if I see a medic trying to go out like that, I, it's, you know, get, you know, you need to get back. That's not the medic's position to do that. That's, <clears throat> that's ticket loss. With Absolutely. the medic so far away. Five, the Another thing too is with fobs, especially enemy fobs. You, you kind of got to gauge where defend. where they're streaming out Take of. Them off as they come in. And then push your guys that direction. Our SFS or SFSS is shooting sure right now. There's nothing that would tell me that there would be a fob in northeast. For a second. Yeah. Be, have you guys I'd be assuming three, four, five, or three yeah, north of trail right. We need everybody there. there. Fractured right now. Everybody's kind of still. SFSS looks like they're going to mount an attack on the village here. Yeah. Only, only three it's a good play, but it's not going to be fast enough. Cap. Yeah, absolutely. I think what they need right now with the rail docks is a 2,000 pound JDAM to get those AOK guys well, out of there. <laughs> I was going to say that, uh, you know, we were talking about this a second ago. Boy, Age of Kill is certainly all piled in there. If you had a couple good grenadiers and potential well-placed rockets, I mean, you could light those guys up. Absolutely. Yeah, there they go. All about terrain position right now. If you zoom out right now, you actually notice. You guys are still on that western hilltop, just west of trail yard, or train yard. Yeah. Very good spread for me, okay. Yeah. They don't want to push any further south because that'd be kind of harassing their main a little bit, so... They're doing is basically just strangling them out. They're keeping them from pushing down that ridge line. Hey, Oaks, is there a is there a fob in the east? Is that yeah, what? Yeah. Um, no, the the farthest the east fob they have is in the like F seven. But that might be with their clubs. Gotcha. Oh, so squad seven has a. Uh, the defense point, and then we lose. We've a got point the rally point out there. I'm just trying to find out what Magoo's doing, taking a medic out like that. Yeah. Yeah, you know, I'm looking at that. That's well. So there's only three people in that squad. I'm wondering if they're just trying to Gary, use that as more of a rover squad into the rail. to to find that stuff. You know what I mean? Divine fobs. Oh, uh, with Gunther and Raleigh in them. Yeah, because there's only three of them in that one. So oh, I wonder if that's just what they're trying to be. That'd be a good movement for a squad where Gunther's at right now. Looks like he's taking fire because of popping smoke. But if SFSS had kicked a small squad out that direction. Maybe it'll do some damage to AOK. Yeah, you know, Chad, you're right about the Grenadiers and, and AR. I mean, I see these SFSS guys running down into the train docks, and it's like, you know, you're going to lose every time if you've got, you know, six guys there with AKs versus one guy with, a you know, an M4. You're going you're gonna to lose every time. If they just sat up in the hills and kind of rained yeah. fire down on them and, and pinned them down, they'd be, have a much right. better chance. Like I, one of my main main things, and I'll say it time and time Pop again, is you don't in, always have to be on the objective to actually play the objective. Defense or attack. Wow! Hey, big shout out to Russ UK for hosting us as well as giving us a huge donation. On, so thanks very much, Russ. So we, can get in the we love Russ. the red coats. We love covering them. And uh, yeah, we looked. There's gonna be a lot more red coat stuff in the future. So 
Uh, more clan stuff in the future too. Oh, absolutely. On, Frickin', uh, it, it, to the audience, you know, we've we've got we've probably got five clans on board right now, chomping at the bit that have not played yet that are trying to go. Uh, so we got two new ones coming off next week with uh, uh, HSG Elite, and then facing off versus Exiled Order. Um, you know, and then we like I said, we've got several more in coming in after moving that. In. So it's better and better. Tickets, tickets, tickets. Oh, shit, 42. that's the match. Needs to be that is the a match. match. Wow. Uh, Chad, why don't you call that? Yeah, that is going to be match. We're calling this 150. Or, uh... 262 left for the... Um... Wow, so yeah, okay. that, over 100 that really... ticket difference. Yeah, wow. that really speaks to the aggressiveness right there of each kill. Like I said before, as a squad lead on this map, you really want to be cognizant of the terrain and the foliage around here. Um, see, this ticket really still gives you a lot of advantages. This ticket's still even going down, just tanking right now. So, are we doing a uh, interview type thing for uh, intermission? Or are we just going to take five, reset, and then come back? Oh, okay. Um, I, see so, what you're, I see what you're saying. It'd probably only take about five minutes to get reset here. Yeah, probably five minutes. Okay. Yeah. All right, so that's going to do it, Twitch chat, for this first match. We're going to come back. We've got another round going on um, between these guys, AOK -OK versus SFSS. We're going to switch sides, get switched up. We'll be following the Frenchies around for the next round. So we'll get to. Uh, we're going to need our train. We're going to need Oakley over here to translate for us. What are they saying, Oakley? <laughs> yeah, that's going to be fun. So uh, we'll see you guys in a few. We're going to go to intermission, fire. and uh, we'll see you guys shortly.